All right, guys, here we go with another Yeti review. This is the Yeti Crossroads 27 liter backpack. Uh, just to go over a little bit on the outside, because I will have an explanation chart here in a moment in the video that explains kind of the dimensions, the weight, all that stuff. And I'll go ahead and drop in a picture of it on my back and then a side view of it on my back, just so you can see how it kind of sets. Uh, super comfortable, very, very lightweight. Uh, pockets everywhere. You got one here, two, three, four. The fourth one back there for your electronics and stuff. And then what's pretty cool is uh, on the sides, we got zippers that go up and down the sides here. And it allows you to stick a, a Rambo in there. So I'm going to go ahead. I've got this thing packed as if I were going to go on like a two day trip. And I'm going to show you what I packed inside this. Again, this is a 27 liter backpack. Um, so you can actually fit quite a bit of stuff in here. These straps right here are if this bag is bulging because this is rated to be able to carry on an airplane and stick up under a seat and whatnot. You can put the containment straps, for lack of better words, on here and cinch them down tighter to maybe kind of bring this in a little bit so it's not so bulky and bulgy. So in here I've got the three straps. We'll go over those in just a second. The nice big uh, compartment right here, two storage areas right here uh, as you can tell I can fit my whole hand in there and each one and then I can fit quite a bit of my hand up in here too so that's where that would get bulky and stick out and you would use these straps okay so you've got three straps like I just said one, two three um, they are adjustable they do unclip and clip in the center it's got a nice big Yeti logo on there um, and these actually just simply go in and hook and it does that on both sides it's going to go in hook mm -hmm. and then you'll tighten it down however tight you need it right and then to relieve the pressure on it you can pop them open like that so now um, on the top compartment here you got reader glasses got to set this stuff off the side here I've got my charging puck for my phone, my AirPods, and I use this primarily for work, so I have my Yeti Hopper Flip 12 zipper lube in there. Uh, and this is like a little keychain lanyard right here. <clears throat> it's pretty neat. Both sides have this little storage area. I've got, this is the 26 ounce uh, Yeti Rambler. That fit right in there. Boom, it's got like a little <clears throat> area right here where it prevents it from going into the rest of the compartment. And you can access that from the side, bring your Rambler out, take a drink, put it back in, zip it down. It's just kind of like an ease of access type deal. The guy on the other side, I don't have another one in there, but see, they've got the protective little layer right there. All right. Loosen this stuff out of the way. Because I actually have a lot packed into this bag. Right? Get into the big compartment here. So, in the big compartment, got another little charging thing. I've got a hoodie, a pair of jeans, one t-shirt, two t-shirts, a pair of joggers, a pair of shorts, 
one, two, three, four pairs of socks. And to top it off, another hoodie. So that all fit in here. You can see how wide this thing opens up. Here's those keepers I was talking about for the Yeti Rambler bottles. Again, goes right in there, zippers up, and it does not float into the main compartment. And I don't even have all of the storage utilized in here. So you got another pocket right here. Uh, possibly you could put your sunglasses there, whatever, if you're traveling. Um, and I've got a couple more things here. Got a razor. <clears throat> Gloss, toothbrush, toothpaste. So you've got this nice little breathable pocket right here. And you also have an additional pocket down here. That you can see these pockets are quite large. I can fit my hand down inside of them. Right, this one goes up actually too. And then that leads me to the back pocket. Zippers are real easy. I don't know if you guys own any of the coolers, like the, the zippable coolers but sometimes their zippers are so robust that they're hard to open and close. These are very, very easy. And they've got that same kind of lining on it. So this is not completely submergible waterproof, but this will repel um, rain, snow, uh, all that good stuff right there. And then this is made for a 13 or 14 inch laptop compartment. I actually have a 15 inch MacBook in there. And then you have a whole other storage area right here for more tablets, uh, headphones, all kinds of stuff. And then even another zipper pocket right here. This is access to this pocket here, okay, if you will. See, got access to that pocket from there. So, no shortage of storage, right? And like I say, this thing is feather light when you don't have anything in it, especially. And that ground control base even works with nothing in it, zipper open. So it's pretty, it's designed pretty good. Another good thing about this ground control base is it's more uh, rip proof material than this. And this is absolutely rip proof. I mean, Yeti makes a really robust product if you've ever, if you've ever used them. All right, on the back here, we've got a big Yeti logo. So you're not forgetting what you're carrying. And then we've got these straps here. And this is where you're gonna go ahead and put your, your chest strap through there, just like we did in the beginning. Hook that right through there like that. Uh, you've got a Yeti branded logo right there. Mine's a little dirty, as you can tell. My table's probably a little dirty, and I use mine. And then something really cool about this is this is a luggage handle pass-through, right? So if you keep if you've got one of those luggage uh, suitcases that got the wheels on them with the extendable handle. You literally just slip this down over that handle and then you don't have to carry your backpack on your back. You just pull that luggage around and it sit, sits right on there nice and secure. Um, good, not super thick, but you can tell they're very padded. I don't know if you can see me squeezing that or not. They're very padded. Um, so one thing I did when I got these here, they were folded up kind of like so in the bag and they have these little keepers around them. Well, these little keepers, they're like a thick rubber band material, right? And I actually couldn't get the strap pulled down far enough uh, because I have a little bit bigger shoulders. And, and this is actually the keeper for the strap right here. So I actually took the strap out of here, put this on there to keep the strap in there. Um, so then when I'm, I've got it on, this little piece isn't flopping around here, take my arm or, or whatever. And I did that on both sides there. I got the other one right down there. So what's really neat too as well is when you have this on, you can pull this to tighten down the strap. And it's, it just tightens really easy, but then it doesn't untighten very easy unless you loosen it up, obviously. You know, so it's really pretty quick on the fly adjustment. So... Yeah, so Yeti's Crossroad 27 liter. If you stuck through the video this far, I appreciate it. And, uh, give me a subscribe if you haven't already uh, because I've got more reviews on the way. All right, guys, take care.